Andy Hudsonite here. Today I'm going to show you how to replace a headlight bulb on a Honda Odyssey. So you want to open the hood and I'm going to be working on the passenger side of the vehicle of my 2004 Honda Odyssey. Access is right back here, right behind the coolant reservoir. So a little bit of space to work with. Uh, there's a clip back here that you want to unsnap. This is just the wiring harness right there. I just pushed on this lever on the side and it came right off. In fact, I think you can just pull it right off. Next, you wanna pull this rubber housing out. Don't worry, you're not going to break this by Pulling it out of its seating, it's just to keep uh, moisture out. And then in here, you'll see the bulb in there. Now there is a, a wiring harness that's holding it in place. And so uh, in order to disengage that, we are just going to push on it. All right, it just kind of swings right out like a gate, you see that? that uh, latch there. And so now we're left with uh, the bulb in there. And to get the bulb out, it just pulls right out. And this is mine that's burned out. Let's see if we can see filament that's broken on it. Anyway, I have high beams, but my low beams are not working. So let's get the new bulb and get this replaced. My particular model takes a 9003, also compatible with the H4. Uh, this is the Extra Vision made by Sylvania, but GE, and there are other brands that make the replacement bulb. Um, so it's going to look like this. And I'll put a link in the description to where you can pick this up or similar items. Now you can pay more and get a bulb that is going to be um, more heavy duty or long, long lasting, but uh, I'm okay with the basic one for our vehicle. Okay, here's the new Sylvania bulb. The uh, thing with this is you want to avoid touching the, the glass area on it. You want to pay attention to these guides in here to see exactly where this, how this is going to go in. So we're going to get this put back into place. Um, a little tricky to see because you don't have a lot of good visibility down here. All right, so I got this set back in. It was a little, it's a little tricky getting the bulb set back in there. I mean, the process is very simple, but you just have to make sure it's seated in there correctly so that that wire harness can go over uh, the bulb and that's actually what holds the bulb in place. So we have that back in. Now we just need to get this um, rubber sleeve put back on and connect the wiring harness and we should be good to go. So we got the wiring harness back on, that rubber sleeve back on. Let's test the lights to see if they're going to come on. Looks like we have success. Got a nice bright headlight on. And again, I'm on the passenger side, and there's the oil dipstick. And that is a video that I have done on how to change your oil, particularly in a Honda Odyssey. And I also did a video on how to replace the battery in a Honda Odyssey. So be sure to watch those. If you want to replace your bulb on the driver's side, it's a little more involved. You've got a uh, a grounding, uh, grounding cable there you may have to take out. You don't have to, but it's going to help with the access. As you can see the, uh, the socket back in there. There's a couple inches of room. You could probably do this by getting your hand in there, especially if you have a smaller hand. If you want complete access, I would recommend removing the battery and also removing this plastic piece to be able to access it. Um, 
you might be able to get that that uh, piece out. I have not done the side on my vehicle before. You might be able to slip that plastic piece out without taking the battery out. Regardless, if you're going to be removing the grounding, I recommend disconnecting the negative lead on your battery first before you do that, just to uh, so you don't risk shorting out uh, your just shorting out your system. So that is how you replace the headlight bulb on your cars, specifically a Honda Odyssey. So thanks again for watching. Make sure to give the video a like, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell so that you can get instant notifications whenever I post new videos.